Django, is base64 of md5 hash of email address under 30 characters? I am investigating since a few hours the best way to use the email address instead of username in Django authentication. This topic has been discussed many times but the given results are inconsistent. 1. The answer here points to a snippet that distinguishes the username and email simply by having an HR in it. The max length of email and username is not equal though and not considered in the answer. 2. The second answer from the same link from s.lot 13 votes is doing some black magic with admin site. It doesn't make sense to me what the code is doing, is this the accepted way of doing it short and sweet? 3. Then I found this solution, which seems almost perfect and makes sense to me. It picks only the first 30 chars of a unique Python generated ID as the username. But there is still a chance of collision. Then I came across a post where someone has claimed a base64 encoding of an MD5 hash has 25 characters. If that's true, couldn't we take the base64 encoding of an MD5 hash of the email address and guarantee 100% unique usernames, which are also under 30 character? If this is true, how could this be achieved? Many thanks. You can do it like this. You can ignore the last char because it's just a new line. The chance of collision is the same as the MD5 hash. You don't lose information when you encode in base64. MD5 hashes are always 16 bytes long, and base64 encodes groups of 3 bytes to 4 characters. Thus, 16 slash 3 rounded up, 6 groups of 3, times 4 is equal to 24 characters for a MD5 hash encoded to base64. However, note that the above-linked Wikipedia page states. However, it has since been shown that MD5 is not collision-resistant. So you cannot count on this method giving you unique usernames from email addresses. Producing them is very easy with the help of the Hashlib module. UUID is 128-bit, thus you could apply base64 on it directly to get a 22 chars long string, by removing fixed padding equal sign as Gumbo suggests in comments of the question. Here, the Earl safe underscore B64 encode and the stripping of equal sign are used to avoid chars that user.username field does not like, including forward slash plus and equal sign. Also, UUID has two bits of fixed 10, hence the 17th char in the hex representation is always 8, 9, B, and four bits of versions, check the wiki. Thus you could throw away the 4 plus 2 equals 6 bits along W slash 2 effective bits to get a 30 chars long hex string. In this way you only throw away 2 effective bits instead of 8 when simply slicing S by S, column 30, and you could expect better uniqueness, 1 quarter coding space of UUID at most. If you want to support the channel, please consider subscribing.